You know what? More than two generations ago, the venture capital community, that is VCs, business angels, incubators, all the rest, convinced the entrepreneurial world that writing business plans and then raising venture capital constituted the twin centerpieces of entrepreneurial endeavor. They did that, of course, for very good reasons. The sometimes astonishing returns they've delivered to their investors and the incredibly large and valuable companies, Apple, Facebook, Google, and so on, that that ecosystem has created. Actually though, the vast majority of fast growing companies never take any venture capital. So where does their money come from? And for you, where might your money come from to start and grow your business? So over the next seven modules, I'm gonna take you around the world to California, of course, but also to entrepreneurial hotspots like India, like Latin America, and more, and to London, where I'm incredibly fortunate to have had the pleasure of working with some of the world's most inspiring young entrepreneurs over the past 15 years at the London Business School. In all those places, we're gonna find inspiring examples, fast-growing entrepreneurial companies of what I hope you, yes, you, will accomplish by taking this course and by putting its ideas to work in your business. So what's our purpose here? My purpose is to get you to abandon what I believe is a misplaced idea, that a VC or an angel investor should be every aspiring entrepreneur's first port of call. Now, you and I know that we've been taught over the past generation or so that the way to start and grow a great business is pretty simple, right? Come up with a great idea, write a great business plan, find an angel or a VC to give you the money you need, perhaps pivot a time or two, and voila, you're rich. Well, I'm here to tell you that it hardly ever happens that way. In fact, the vast majority of fast-growing companies like those on the Inc. 5000 list in the USA or the Fast Track 100 in the UK or other lists where you live never raise any venture capital. So why are we here together? From the title of this course, you know what my objective is. It's to unlock the secrets of starting and growing your business without VC and show you how to put those secrets to work in your business. Now, how might you do that? Well, instead of getting the money you need from an angel or a VC, I hope to convince you that the place to get the money is the same place Bill Gates and Paul Allen did, and Michael Dell too, get it from your customers. Now, it turns out there's enough substance here that I've written a really good book on this topic. It's called The Customer Funded Business, which explains when to use each of the five customer funded models, and yes, there are five of them, how best to put those five models to work, and what you might wanna watch out for, the pitfalls you'll inevitably encounter as an entrepreneur, when you put them to work. But of course, not every entrepreneur in the world has the time to read a whole book. And in many parts of the world, it's not easy or maybe not affordable to get your hands on the book either. So this MOOC is gonna give you what you need to know to start and grow your customer funded business in a fraction of the time and at zero expense. So to get you started, I'm gonna give you the preface free It'll give you the lay of the land. You'll be able to download it here and read it, so you'll be up to speed for the first module. Finally, one more thing. There's a short survey I've created to give all of us a better idea of who we're all in bed with here. There's a whole bunch of us from around the world, so that I can make sure I address your needs and so that you can get the most value out of the discussion board from others in your country, others in your market, others in your industry, and so on. So if you'd be kind enough to take a few minutes to complete it, that would be fantastic. It's completely anonymous, we don't need your name. We'll tabulate the results and we'll post them so you can all see who's on board. Now, I hope you'll join us for the rest of this journey. I promise you it's gonna be an exhilarating and eye-opening ride.
Thank you.